guys, so Bob Blacker here, and sorry you're staring at my carpet for a bit. Um, I'm going to do a collection tour of my briars. Um, all sizes, like traditionals, classics, um, stable meats. Um, I only have one mini Winnie, and I can't find her at this moment in time. So she will sadly not be in it. But if you go to my blog, I have a picture of her. Um, it'll also include my schlikes, my customs. And, um, any other extra animals that are, like, certain brand. So, yeah, let's get started. Okay, sorry it's so dark over here, um, but I did some rearranging, and, um, to actually get light over here, any light at all, I had to hang, you can't see them, but I had to hang flashlights, you can sort of see them. I had to hang flashlights. <laughs> to actually get any light back here, um... But yeah, that's just because my iPod has crappy quality. Um, anyway, I'll start off with my traditionals. Um, and bring them into better lighting so you can actually see them. Here's good lighting. More of a piece of paper there. Um, my first one I have is Sunny. Her name used to be one, but I kind of got into the habit of calling her Sunny after I made a little video with her. Um, so this is Sunny, or Sunny Day. She's a retired mold. Um, I can't remember what mold she is exactly. I looked her up just to, because I always like to, um, like if I get one at a yard sale or something, I always have to figure out how much it sells for online or something, like, or stuff like that. But she is a retired mold. Um, I just can't remember which mold she is, which makes me sad. Um, I really love this mold. Um, I like her tail. She's in a really good condition, actually. Um, from what I see, she has she's got pretty much perfect paint, except for some chips on her um, tail, and she's got a black mark on her jaw. But other than that, I'm really in love with her. I love her shading. I love how her black is. So yeah, that's my first traditional. Ouch. And I ordered some more, um, but they're not going to be here for a while, so I'll introduce them to you when they get here. I got this guy for Christmas. He's my Christmas Eve briar. Um, he's the only briar I got for Christmas. He's the traditional spirit of the West. Although, um, it's kind of weird because, I don't know if it's because of the different years they were made, she is a lot bigger than him. Um, I don't know if it's the pose, or, but she's just a lot bigger than him. And my classic tack cannot fit on her. Like, the saddle can't even go around her or anything. The, um, bridle and stuff doesn't fit her. But it fits him perfectly. So, I'm debating whether I really call him traditional or not. Um, but it said traditional in the box. He's the 1.9 scale, so. Um, he's a really pretty mold. I love him to death. <laughs> um... I actually knew I was getting him for Christmas because um, I ordered him with my mom and I was originally going to pay my mom for him after Christmas, like with Christmas money, but my mom gave him to my pap and um, my pap gave him to me on Christmas Eve. So I mean I really love his coloring, he's just a gorgeous mold. If you don't have him and are thinking about him, I highly recommend him. Um, he's just so gorgeous. I love his blanket, how it is. I actually took a picture of just his blanket, like that. Everybody thought he was like, um, the little Ricky Rocker, or however you say it. I always get it mixed up. Tongue twister. <laughs> um, but he's definitely a sweet mold, and I love him. So he's currently staying here until we get the rest of our stuff. Um, my classics... I have Sparrow, or, oh, I didn't tell you his name. This is, um, Buckeye. He doesn't have a show name yet, so if you have show name suggestions, I will gladly take them. And if I pick yours, I might give you a shout out on YouTube or something. I don't know. <laughs> um, oops, he just fell over. Sorry. <laughs> um, here we have Sparrow. He's my classics. I have... One, two, three, four, four classics, two traditionals, twelve stable mates, and one mini winnie. Um, from Briar, and then I'm not sure how many Schleich and Papo or and Safari I have. Um, but this is Sparrow or Captain Jack Sparrow. 
Um, he came in a vet kit. Oh my gosh, I just love him. He's so cute. I pretend, even though Sonny's a traditional and he's a classic, I pretend he's Sonny's full. But I really love him. And I love how he's got his black hoof and the rest are white. Then here, let's get his blanket off. We have Captain, or Captain America. And a um, question for you guys, if any of you have him, is his star like that on him? Because when I got him, it was like that, and I don't know if it's a man manufacturing error or what, but... Um, anyway, I really love him. I love how he's got the white leg. <laughs> um, I wish he would have had a little more white on him, like if he would have had some white up around like here or something. But I really like him. And then we have, ouch, we're having issues, I'm trying to get his halter off. We have Pinocchio. Um, I really like his mold. I wish he had a different tail though because his tail is like really fragile and I don't want anything to happen to his tail. So, and I usually keep a blanket on him so he doesn't get scratched or anything. But I really like him. His muzzle is a nice color. I like his mane. He doesn't stand very well on carpet though, but he stands perfectly fine in his barn. Um, let's see. Sorry about that. That was really weird. My iPod froze up. My last classic is um, the Dauphin. Um, his barn name is Dauphin, or um, and his shoe name is Little Prince. This is my first shipping boot blanket and boot set I made. Um, I think it turned out pretty good, um, getting Instagram messages stuff, so, um, I've, I made this, like, a week ago, and I haven't taken him, taken it off of him, because I don't want it to, like, I don't want him to get scratched or anything, but he's the Palomino, he's beautiful, I, I absolutely adore him, he was my very first briar, so I adore him, so let's put you all back in your stalls. Oh no, he fell over. Oh well, he can stay over. Um. Sorry, my iPod keeps stopping on me, so if it suddenly cuts off, I'm really sorry. Um, my animals I have. Um, I have two classic animals and two traditional. I have uh, the traditional calf. This is Monopoly. Or, um... I don't remember. His name's Monopoly, and he's so cute. And then I have Sheba, who is the traditional dog that came with the Spirit of the West. So did Monopoly. Then we have um, Liberty, who came in the same set that Sparrow did, along with um, Snowball. So, yeah. Anyway, moving on. Sorry it's so dark over here. I don't know why it's so dark over here. Um, I'm going to end up skipping. Actually, never mind. Ignore that. Um, anyway, this is my um, stablemate and stablemate sized horses. Um, ooh, sorry. Um, here we have Elmer. Um, I don't. He doesn't have a shame. Here we have Rose. Or um, Roses of Rushmore. Um, Pavel. Uh, he doesn't have a shame. Um, but I got his name from the Boy in the Striped Pajamas, because I watched that, and I just got him, and I'm like, oh, I'll name him Pavel. Here we have Oreo, or Sweet Dream, and this was a mystery full set. I have all three mystery full sets from, I think they were the 2013 ones. They might have been the 2013, or I don't know. Um, Jean, she doesn't have a show name. Brantley, he doesn't have a show name. Esperanza, hope of my life. Here you can't see her very well because she's all black. Um, right here. This is Diamond or Diamond Blues. I'd take her out, but then everybody would fall over. <laughs> here we have Kenobi or Obi-Wan Kenobi and Lancelot or White Knight. We have Arrow or Hit the Bullseye. Um, Winnie or um, Red Solo Cup or Colorado Gem. Um... Here we have one of my customs. Um, this is Legacy or Racing Dream. Um, here we have Jet 
or what is your shoe name? Um, what is her shoe name? I forget her. He doesn't know her name. And this is my newest custom I made in memory of my grandmother. Um, my grandmother passed away, or <laughs> de yeah, December fourteenth, twenty fourteen. It's late. I'm tired. Um, this was her card that we got at the funeral. Um, so, her birthday and stuff. Um, she passed away from colon cancer. And so I made this custom in memory of her. Um, I still need to make one for my other grandmother who passed away from, I think, I can't remember. She didn't have, like, any special, um, that she passed away from. She didn't have, like, cancer or anything, but she, I think something happened with, like, her body just shut down. But I want to make one in memory for her. But, um, since colon cancer is dark blue, uh, he's got dark blue socks, a dark blue blaze, and a dark blue, um, ribbon. And he usually just sits there on top of the card. Here we have some of my customs. You can't see them very well because it's kind of dark. But we have Miss Sun, Cat. I'm just going over normal names right now. Because um, most of these guys don't have show names. Eclipse, Jolie, um, Bandit, um, Black Pearl, and we have this little beauty who I did not too long ago. Can't really see her, but she's got some specks on her back. I really like how she turned out. She was actually a Burger King toy that I turned into a... Yeah. If you watch my one video on her. And then I consider these guys, even though they're um, porcelain. Um, we have... Um, wait, did I tell you her name? Her name's Dream. Or, yeah, Dream. Dream? Dreamer. I don't know. <laughs> and we have these two over here who don't have names, but I can them as customs. And my last custom is over here, um, other than these two, which you just saw, um, I think. No, I have one more, but I'll, I'll skip him. Um, this is, um, oh, what did I, I forget what I named her, but she just got a new paint job and everything, and got new black streaks on her hair, so, yeah, she needs a name. So if you have sh er, name suggestions, she'd, she'd like a name. So, moving on to Safari, Peppo, and Shalike. Okay, it's kind of dark over here too. Um, so yeah, uh, bear with me. <laughs> um, this is Zephyr. I'm just going to do um, Zephyr, Renegade, Shenandoah. This is Jenny. She's on the shelf because um, the set she came with is on the shelf. Um, this is Anthem. He's the 2013... Blanket Abbey Stallion. Um, this is my Peppo Full. Her name's Button. Then we have my Schleich, um, Clydesdale, um, Caspian. <laughs> Sorry. Then we have Tiny. Jenny came in. We have Quincy, who's wearing his blanket because he looks handsome in the blanket. Smokey, Bella, um, Pastel, and then my larger safari horses, um, you can't really see them because they're both dark. I have the, um, Arabian, um, her name's Amelia, and I also have the Shire Stallion, um, his name's Frodo. Then we have my larger Peppo, um, this is, um, Boomer. With his rider Roy. <coughs> Sorry. And then over here, I'm not sure what brand these guys are. Um, but we have Calypso. She's a blanket Abby and her full <coughs> excuse me. Lehigh. We have um Katari and her twins. Um, you can't really see her because she's a darker color. This is Quinn. She's like a brown bay. No, she's not bay, she's brown or something like that. <coughs> Sorry. Um, and then we have November. Then we have their dad, um, her, their dad, um, <laughs> Romeo. He looks a lot, he looks exactly like, um, Quintessa. And then you can't see these guys at all, but they're, 
it's Gretchen and her full um, Grayson. You can see them in. You can see all these guys back then. So moving on to our last portion. Okay, and now we're back over to the dresser. Um, these guys are all safari here. Ooh. I think they're all safari. Only two of them might not be safari. Anyone? Um, actually a couple of them aren't safari. Um, this one's not safari. This one's not safari. This one's not safari. This one's not safari, this one's not safari. These guys came in one of those safari fun tube things. Um, in here we have Geminin with her rider, who has no name. Then we have um, Thorin, who's a Clydesdale. Um, we have Sarah, who is I think a quarter horse, maybe? What is she? She's actually... Yeah, she's a quarter horse. Um, I named her after one of the horses at the barn I ride at. Here we have Moonbeam. Um, what is your name? I can't think of her name. We have Seance, which is an Arabian, I believe. Yeah, Arabian. Their breeds are written on their belly. Um, we have... Um, Kiro, um, Bomber, Joker, Indian, and I can't remember these guys' names. Um, what is your name? And I have their name down somewhere, I just can't remember them. I forget his name. And his holes, they're just sort of lying there. This one is actually... Um, Sarah's full, and this one is um, Moonbeam's full. So, thank you for watching, we really appreciate it. Actually, this little guy here. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye!